the amount of people like you said Jordan Peterson just got a strike right yep. now. It's like Tim Dillon, you got freaking suspended. Yep. Theo Vaughn. It's like it really is. You know how people all used, to, oh, used to be like, oh, left versus right. It's really just like people who got their heads in the sand and then people who don't. Man. Turkeys versus it's the rest like of us. The freaking turkeys versus the rest of us. Like, <laughs> how do you not see that they're, they're like you know what I mean? The turkeys have Well, they always assumed because the assumption over was, the mill. Well, yeah, and the assumption too was like on YouTube is like, yeah, if you're like a small account, you're kind of gonna get screwed, but like the big ones are protected. That's what it felt like. Right? That they always felt like, oh, well, if you get to a certain level, they're not like unless you're like egregiously like doing like Steve will do it, like gambling stuff that they're keep repeatedly asking you to not do. Even him was a friggin' hit job too. Oh, whatever, but at least like apparently they were asked him many times. This is just like Tim Dillon makes a joke about like Joe Biden being a lizard and they go, All right, one week suspension. Yeah, he's actually not a lizard if you know the misinformation <laughs> policy. Yeah, exactly. And they're like, well, technically by our policy, he's not a lizard. He's a real person. So... No, nah, it's getting out of control. They, they, you know, they're, they're not no lamer person to be right now than being like, "Oh, I'm sorry, are you censored?" You're like, "Yeah, no one this is crappy." <laughs> it's, like, it's like, yeah, no, this sucks. Yeah, and they're sucks. Just like, legitimately, it's just like, I mean, uh, I guess it's like election. I mean, it sucks for us too because it's like you know we have a podcast like that on YouTube, and so what we just like have to like. Co- totally like censor ourselves to like it's so crazy. You no, know and I was kind of making me laugh. The idea of like the uh, just a, a commercial for conspiracy guys where it's like if you want to be in conspiracies, but like you don't want anyone to you know like paint you with a bad brush and get kicked off. Like introducing like conspiracies that you're allowed to be in there. <laughs> Bigfoot. It's like oh that's a fun one. Like well how about that? It's like you're allowed to talk about Bigfoot all you want. It's like there's no you can't even though now if you're a Bigfoot you guy be- people are like oh let me guess you like Trump too huh? <laughs> you can't be. A it's Bigfoot just like you're guy. now in bed with they lump you in like you can't be into anything alex jones didn't do but you could probably be like i'm into alex jones's bill hicks like you could probably sure like you know what i mean because it's not really a misinformation like a guy could be on there and be like you know you could say anything you want you'd be like oh i think the color blue is the color red they're not gonna ding that it's just they have their ones that they don't like the new england patriots oh that's a fun one for you (laughs) (laughs) inflating the balls like you know what i mean yeah yeah yeah. you start cheating in sports or whatever exactly you it's sort of like fun conspiracies that you're allowed to be (laughs) into <laughs> well, it's kind of what They'll it still is. ding you though. I don't think you. I think you're allowed to talk about the Patriots conspiracies. I mean, like even JFK now, probably because of the RFK stuff. And he goes, "Oh, you JFK? Oh, so you're an anti vaxxer And you go, "What? I didn't even say anything like that." And they go, "Well, they're related." So. Yeah, UFOs. You could probably be into like they don't mind you being like that. You'd be like, "Oh, like you could say Jesus was black." That'd probably be like a hot. That'd be a fun one for you. Yeah, well, there you go. <laughs> There's a lot of people. I don't just don't say you know you're allowed to say Jesus is black. Don't say black people or something else. Yeah, though. yeah, yeah. No, no. <laughs> That's how you get into. You know, Malaysian airline, you could probably poke your nose around into that a yeah, little bit. Yeah, I think so. But I mean, I guess if you say certain things, they'll still. Death you know. of Martin Luther King, you might be able to get into as long as you don't mention the CIA by name. <laughs> <laughs> But it really is like anything with like, you know, as soon as you get on Ukraine, election, COVID, blah, blah, blah. It's like all that stuff. It's like they're really, really cracked. But there's also no distinction between jokes about these things and speaking about these things. Well, the whole things. thing's a fucking joke. So. <laughs> <laughs> it's like literally none. There's, well, like, there's just like some web crawler or whatever that just like sees the words and they go, well, yeah, I don't know. Well, if you can't have, if you can't do like uh, jokes in the realm of Carver, then I guess you should kick off Fauci because he's a fucking COVID joke. <laughs> Well, you give him some makeup remover so he can get that clown makeup <laughs> off his goddamn face because he's a fucking joke. <laughs> What's that sound? Yeah, how about that? If you want to fucking look in the mirror and fucking kick yourself off, how about that? <laughs> <laughs> but we're getting in dangerous territory here, right? I know, man. It's like <laughs> friggin', I'm telling you. I felt, honestly, the last four years, I felt just back in high school in the principal's office, <laughs> just nonstop. Dude, we're literally like we are being held by our ankles, head above the toilet. It's just been flushed. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Fauci's flushing <laughs> it. Flush, Fauci's flushing it. And we're about to just get dunked by Biden. Perpinda or Papindapar, whoever <laughs> runs Google now. <laughs> like, I, Sunder Poonchai. <laughs> yeah. Just fucking got you fucking hanging by your ankles, <laughs> taking your change out. And he's like, he got this, he takes your change. And he's like, and I'm going to replace that with social change. <laughs> That's the only change that I have to use. It's fucked up. Well, then why are you taking my change? Because I fucking can. That's what he'd say to you. So people, I, it really safe. is. Yeah, it's like the only conspiracy that you can talk about with the Clintons is like, how fucking did she look so hot? <laughs> yeah. It's a conspiracy. She, what's her skincare routine? <laughs> and then someone's like, in the comments, it's like, it's adrenochrome. And you go, here we go. All right. I can't even talk about The conspiracy that. of like, how is she so hot at 80? <laughs> What's well, her secret? That's 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 a secret conspiracy you can talk about. Ooh, yeah. 
Uh, I mean, oh, the Obama's so cool. That's the only type of stuff you're allowed to get into. Have, have you seen that new the new sex, sex trafficking movie thing that's coming out? This big the Mel Gibson, Jim Caviezel, and all fucking spank material for you. The, well, no, they're trying to they're trying to paint it as a QAnon movie, even though it's oh, literally yeah. just like an anti child trafficking movie. Apparently, it's like they did like ten million dollars in pre sale movie theater tickets. Like okay. it's actually going to do well, like legitimately. And then like people are like, it's a QAnon movie. And you're like, some. They always find something wrong with it. Look at this guy. He doesn't like sex trafficking. <laughs> He's sex trafficking children. Guys, like it's they like do. Based there on are a conspiracy true story. theorists. Yeah, yeah. Like based on a true story. <laughs> like, like, yeah, honestly, some of these. Sometimes it's just like I'm a I'm a flip switch away from going full all in. Fucking oh, Alex Jones. Then they get you. I'm getting closer, man. I'm telling you, they know. get you. <laughs>